All right, so in this tutorial, I'll show you how to add a slider for controlling the size of the brush. So let's go ahead and get started on that right away. We're just going to add a slider to our list called Shape Size, or let's just do Size Slider. It's easier to type. Size Slider, and that's kind of hard to say. And this is actually not going to be in our drawing panel. This is going to be in our brushes panel, so I'm going to initialize it with the other side sliders. Size slider equals new J slider, 0 to 200. Um, yeah, sure. And then, uh, so it'll be a disappearing brush. All right, so then we want to just copy everything that we have done for the other sliders, basically. And instead of blue slider, I'm going to do size slider, copy, paste, 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 and size. And set tick spacing at, let's say, 20, I don't know, sure. And set value to, that's going to be huge, so let's start it at 20. And then... Uh, we need to add it to the panel. We'll add it at the end. Panel one. Dot add size slider. But then we need to change what it does in the change listener uh, when uh, the size slider is clicked. Uh, oh no. Uh, no, when we are drawing, we don't actually need to change anything there. So under mouse dragged, what we're going to do instead of this 2020 thing uh, is we're going to just say size slider dot get value. And I'm going to type that again or copy and paste it for the other 20. And you could have a width and a height slider. Um, and that should actually, I believe, work. So if we see now there is a size slider, the ticking is wrong. I should have done it differently. But you can change the size of your brush and, I believe, actually change the brush. So that's pretty cool. Um, I wanted to do one other thing. Uh, it's weird that the brush is drawing in the upper right hand or upper left hand corner, so let's change that. Instead of having e.getx and e.gety right there, which defines where the ellipse double will be drawn, uh, let's do this. So int draw x equals e dot get x but we don't want it to just be x we want it to be like in the middle so you have to subtract half the size minus size slider dot get value divided by two and uh, if you think about that one for a little while you will it will make sense and so we're going to do that for y also so not draw x we're going to do draw y get y and then here instead of just get x we're going to draw x and draw y and so that will solve the problem of it kind of being a wonky drawing thing I believe yep so you can see that the mouse is in fact in the middle of the shape rather than at the top left corner um, now let's fix that tick spacing because that drives me a little nuts. So let's scroll back up and if we have the size sliders, tick spacing, this should be something more like uh, 52. So I think that should clean it up. Yep. So that's a pretty clean little uh, drawing program there that you have. Uh, and that is the end of this tutorial.